Hey fans, it's time to catch up with another Reds hero from the past. Join us for Where Are They Now? Presented by Humana. High fly ball, left field. Foster's got a shot. They're tagging up at third. Here comes the throw. It is in time. I just think back at 75 uh, when I got the chance to start every day in the lineup. But Sparky called me into the office saying, you're going to get an opportunity to play every day. And that's something I always looking forward to. So he moved Pete Rose to third base and put me in left field. And from that day on, I was out there starting. Hi, I'm George Foster. I played with the Cincinnati Reds from 1971 to 1981. There are a lot of favorite memories. Maybe someone would say hitting three home runs in one game or being in the uh, World Series. But the one that really sticks out is when I hit 50, 50, 52 home runs in 1977. Why? Because Number one, I become the only, the only Reds player to accomplish that feat. And the other one that really stands out is that my idol, Willie Mays, had done that. So I was able to do something that he had accomplished. It was a dream come true, something that I always wanted to do. It's something that my idol was doing, and I got, I got a chance to play alongside Willie Mays. And not too many people can say they reached their dream and then play aside a, a person that they, they looked look as their mentor. Well, today I have a 15U team that I'm, I've been following since I believe they were like 12, so I'm, my goal is to follow them through high school because I want to be, be the manager or the coach of the team so we, I can somewhat mold them into the player that I feel they should be. And I have some kids that are, have a lot of talent, a lot of ability now, but instilling them the work ethics that they need to do. So for me, it, it makes me feel the young again, being able to go out there, throw batting practice, hit bongos, uh, and, and manage the game. So, and, and just seeing the, the excitement in their eyes when they do something well. And, and them learning how to play as a team and start believing in themselves. When I go in the gym, I work on my legs, I work on my core, I work on my arms. But the bottom line is to enjoy life. Uh, you want to have a quality life, and to have a quality life, you want to stay healthy.